a lot of uh, people in the Republican Party, the establishment, uh, have lent money to 527s that are bashing Rick Scott, almost calling him a crook. And um, McCullum himself ha has gone on television and so forth, trying to tie him to this billion, $1.7 billion fine for Medicaid, Medicare fraud. What happens if Rick Scott wins and, uh, you know, he's been labeled as a crook by the Republicans? Uh, what do they say when they moved in the general election? And is he, is he a damaged candidate going into that general election? Well, they have a little bit of a problem, don't they? I mean, they, they, they are That's going Charlie. to spend the next couple of months leading up to the primary, uh, as you said, trying to tie Rick Scott to uh, the federal charges that the company he ran uh, faced. And, and as Brent said, he wasn't charged with anything, but they're going to try very hard to make sure that when people think of Rick Scott, they think of Medicare fraud, Medicaid fraud. Um, they're going to hear those words together a lot. As you say, uh, that presents a little bit of a problem if Rick Scott wins that primary. And then you have that period from August to November where the Republican Party establishment would then be in the position of trying to get behind a candidate that they've just spent a couple of months basically calling a crook. And, and I'm not sure how you do that. I mean, of course, you always have this in, in primaries. You always have, mm -hmm. you know, well, what about what you said during the primary? Well, that was just politics. That gets in, you know, that happens in primaries. But this is a little different. This is, they're very forcefully going after Rick Scott. He's an outsider. The insiders are going after him hard. And, and I think that is going to be a problem. Um, but he's got a lot of money, and he's going to be on TV a lot. And, uh, and it may not be a, and he's a huge issue. Too. He, yeah, well, yeah. Th yeah, he has. He's, he's basically, he's gotten out in front of that issue as best he can, and he said, look, here's what happened. Um, you know, he's, he hasn't tried to hide it. Uh, you know, here's what happened, but I didn't get charged. But it, that, that is a unique problem that the Republicans will have.